We've got things in the mail to show to you. Hi. I'm going to see the things he's got in the mail. All right. Yeah. No, I'd you need some stuff. Kind of, I've opened some of this stuff preemptively because some of it I just wasn't sure. Like some of it looked like this came from a video game publisher. I don't know that this is I, I keep gross. accidentally opening mailbag no, stuff. No, this stuff didn't. <laughs> I keep accidentally opening mailbag stuff because I think it's Amiibos that I bought. Uh -huh. And then it's just like, oh, it's a thing. Because you, so. you've, you've sunk to the level where you're just like buying used amiibos, amiibos from like weirdos now. So I mean, the boxes eBay. don't look like. Yeah, I mean, it's from eBay. So like I'm getting a bunch of those normal boxes that are hastily taped up. It's right. not like yeah. Amazon stuff. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Uh, this is from Rory, uh, I believe is in Manchester. Um, it says, after the lukewarm reception of the energy drink Pussy, I have decided to play it safe and send you a selection of products from Scotland's number one soft drinks manufacturer, AG Bar. I think they make uh, uh, Iron Brew. Iron Brew? Iron Brew? Iron Brew? Brew? No. Brew. It's, not, it's not beer. Okay. It's a soda. It's like, so like a Fago orange of kind of. It, yeah, it's the Fago of Scotland. Okay. Sure. Um, eh. I agree. Mm, Fago, the Fago. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. That's hard to say. Hard to say. Iron Brew is... Some people, like, really obsessively try to get it here. Is it a like, novelty thing? Yeah, I can't. I think here, okay. like, there it's probably just on store shelves. Or, okay. All right. Or something. But, uh, they should rename it to Scotland. Probably, yeah. for the election season. Just yeah, rename it to Scotland. Uh, there's also a healthy selection of Cadbury's chocolate and Bengali savory snacks from my local corner shop. Okay, Rory. We got some Walkers, Tear and Share, Thicker Cut Crisps, Sweet Chili. Okay. Wait, crisps like chips? Yeah. Okay. Crisps like chips. I gotta get on the desk before I It's a bag and a bowl. It's like a bread bowl? It's a bag and a bowl. Oh, the bag itself is one. Okay. Ha <clears throat> tear and Share. Oh, okay. Hang on, please. It says place thumbs here. Okay, all right. Both place thumbs there. Oh, wait, it looks like you just gotta do a. I think it's like this. Like, um, thumb, thumb, tear, share. Right. It's a bag and a bowl. I mean, it's more of a bag. That's actually super handy. Also, wow, those taste really good. Oh, yeah. Is your chili flavored? Mm hmm. Sweet chili. Oh, these are great. These are really good. Kind of vinegary. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. I don't like vinegar, but like salt and vinegar chips or vinegar flavored chips are great. Um, they, they taste like vinegar. Mm hmm. We've got some, uh, some burdock and dandelion. Okay. Bird, dandelion and burdock, actually, I think is probably. Dave and Buster's. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, some red cola. Special price, 49p. What color is it? Looks like black, probably. Is it, is it P of Pence? Mm hmm. Tizer. The Great British Pop. Hmm. I'll be the judge of that. Get this cola. You gotta make those cold. And some bar diet cola, 39p. Real savings here. We got some uh, some fish and chips, crackers, curry sauce. Oh, oh that sounds amazing. yeah, let's try that. And it looks like a newspaper. Yeah, I really like that bag bowl thing. It's really great. Oh, these are like Gardettos. It's just a bunch of crap in there. Okay, that looks good. All right, try one of these here. Is it fishy? Is it what? Are they? Is it fishy? Not too bad. No, it's pretty good. Or is it like fisherman? Or is it like a, like, like goldfish? Like, 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 okay, so it's, it's like not necessarily dusting. fish. It's just fish-shaped, like goldfish crackers. Yeah, it has a consistency of like a cereal. Yeah, cool. Oh, this is. Oh. I like it. That's uh, that's pretty good. It's a little. Hmm? Yeah, they're shaped. They're circular ones that are supposed to be fish, and the longer ones are supposed to be the chips, which means fries. Fried peas. Hmm. Eh, that sounds too healthy. 25. I mean, it says, like, the first word is fried. Does that immediately disqualify something from being healthy? There's uh, no fried in healthy a lot thing? Of cases. What about, like, fried asparagus? Can you fry asparagus? You probably could, but you're, like, you're inserting a lot of oil into it that is then... Okay. Uh, yeah. My fingers are now covered in film from mm -hmm. the other stuff, so it's oh, yeah. really hard to... I think I would have learned my lesson about eating way too much stuff sent in because since that Mario Party, uh, mm -hmm. I felt like shit the rest of the night. Well, Mario Party all over it too. Right, right, yeah. No, the uh, Oreos. Uh, Drew, I think you and I probably ate the most yeah. of those. Yeah, I think I had totally like four fine. Oreos or something. I probably here, you yeah. try and open the well over a dozen, well. I think. While I move on here, my hands are all gross too now. I've got some salt and vinegar of the same, the same fish and chips there. Oh, so that sounds that's great. That's all right. I got those. 
uh, some chocolate, which I got into at one point. It's put uh, put malt vinegar on your fish and chips? Uh, I no, mm. I'm, I don't. I really don't like vinegar. Mm. I really don't like vinegar. There's like little bits and pieces of it, and like you know that you taste here that like I can handle, but like anything much more vinegary than that is too much. That's why any salad dressing that had like vinaigrette in the name, I didn't want to eat because it reminded me of vinegar. I don't like vinegar. Yeah. This looks real good. I like toffee a lot. These fried peas are pretty good. Mm. Well, yeah, they're just salty, like you know wasabi peas or something like that. I don't like know? wasabi peas. Yeah, but they're these are not wasabi though. Okay, so. Yeah. These are fine. They're mm, inoffensive. Right. Yeah. This toffee stuff is super good, though. What, is this Cadbury? We have Cadbury here. Yeah. Uh, but Cadbury, they make up way more stuff than cream eggs, as it okay. turns out. It just says Dahl Pran Dahl. Mm. I don't... Is this just like quinoa turned into chips? I like quinoa a lot. Oh, no. Dude, what? I'm fucking... Terrible here. Now I have chocolate and the curry dust uh -huh. on my fingers. Yeah. Still. Is that a Turkish delight? Okay. Mm. This is a chocolate candy thing. Is it? I think so. Yeah. I don't think I don't think no. Turkish delight is chocolate. No, it's. Well, it's Turkish delight wrapped in milk chocolate. Okay. All right. Is this food or is this like flower seeds? I don't know. Only one way to find out. It's got calorie stuff on the back. Or kilojoules or whatever they say. pinch between the cheek and gum. Yeah. It's, they're seeds. They're, you know, like sunflower seeds or something. Okay. Try planting them. Those are alright. I won't put them in my mouth while I have all this chocolate and toffee in there. This delicious chocolate and toffee. Uh, I got some other cans here. Oh, some Iron Brew. Okay. Mm. Yeah. I remember that being real good. It's, uh, it's alright. Oh, some, some pussy as well. Okay. Yeah. That's pussy. Fruit Passion and fruit and lime. All right. And uh, bubble gum. Ooh. All right. Oh, weird. Nice bubble gum flavored soda. It's been a long time. These seed things are super weird. I think they just seem to like, I don't know. They're a weird taste to me. Mm. I don't know about that. Yeah, well. It tastes like a hard boiled egg. What? Yeah, try it. That can't be right. Maybe when you mix it with the chocolate somehow. Yeah. They're interesting if they're at space I see what you're saying. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's, a, it's a little eggy. It's a uh -huh. little eggy. Oh. Is that like little egg bits, maybe? No, hard? probably not. No. I'm not sure what's in this one. <clears throat> we know you guys don't uh, need any more knickknacks for your desks, but we sort of just amassed all this stuff over the past couple of years, and some of it is way too cool to give away to just anybody. Uh, we wanted to give the sheriff's badge to Danny O'Dwyer when we saw him at Pack South, but we never got the chance. Uh, now he can be a real-life Irish Texas cowboy lawman. Um, the newspapers used to paddle this stuff are actually some sort of used airplane ads that this weird guy at work keeps giving me. Uh, so Skyler and Nick in Texas. Okay. Ads for used airplanes? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. You want to buy a plane? Yeah. How, how much are we going for? That one's three hundred ninety thousand. Right. That's four hundred ten thousand. Is that American dollars? Yeah. Make offer for this Lear Jet, this nineteen ninety Lear Jet. I got like a twenty. All right. This is ninety nine thousand. That's you know, entering, getting closer to affordable, I guess. One hundred ninety nine thousand. One point seven million. For this 1995 Cessna Citation Jet, it's got a DVD player in it. Hmm. That seems dangerous. Yeah. Uh, okay, here's some bubble wrap. Here's some more planes here. Trade your Cessna for a Cessna from the world's largest Cessna dealer. Cessnas. Oh, missing. Nice. Modernize your Meridian. Controller? Is that a. Controller. Periodical? Controller.com, the marketplace for piston aircraft. I'm going there. All right, here, no, here, I'll, I'll save these for you. You should buy a plane. Okay. Uh, it's a small price to pay for being able to fly. Yeah, to just go like, oh, let's go. Where do you want to go? I don't know. Well, actually, you probably have to file a flight plan, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, you have to get all sorts of like permits and stuff, I think. And mm -hmm. what? Huh? 
Oh yeah, look these chips. Okay. It's got a bowl here. Why do you have a, Can I, why are you wearing Canadian pajamas? This is what it got sent to me that I thought was Amiibos, but it's really just big Canadian pajamas. But I got a butt flap on my stuff for the first time. I mean, like the, the actual reason for these existing in old tiny pajamas is so you could poop easier, right? I assume so. Yeah? I don't know. I've never had a pair of the... I don't the, know. It seems less convenient to put this whole thing on than to just pull down some normal pajama pants. Well, back then, everything was cold all the time. Oh, yeah, yeah and you had to like go out to an outhouse right. or something. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so okay. Freezing, yeah. So. Makes sense. We got a uh, limited edition Japanese vinyl. It says Japanese right on it. Yeah, you can tell. Here, a little transformer here. A little bumblebee. That's I don't cool. think that'll go in a turntable. Yeah, I think you're probably right. We can melt it down. Okay. This actual Transformers branding? Yeah. Uh, we've got oh, Dallas. Cool. The Tom Skerritt action figure. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a great, it's a good beard. This is, yeah. Wow. Wow. Look at, these are, te look, I mean, look at the alien. Yeah. It's kind of not great. <laughs> it kind of oh. looks like it did an alien. <laughs> Needs to be more hunched over. Oh, here's a, man. Here's a Kyle Reese. <laughs> look at the little trench coat. <laughs> That's a really great trench coat. <laughs> cool. Take its head off. Not bad for a one. The Terminator. Yep, that classic Arnie look there. <laughs> Spitting image. Yeah. <laughs> really got the physique down. Yeah. It's kind of amazing. Mm. I've got a Star Trek transporter room, which is good for these guys. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. To go on adventures. Well, their clothes all get ripped off if you put them in there, so be careful. Right. Bonus Scotty figure included. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. I, think maybe, I think maybe the battery's dying on that. I don't know. Got a Andre the Giant book. Uh, this is, I think, the the Andre the Giant movie they're making is probably based on this. They're making mm. an Andre the Giant movie? Yeah. Who's playing Andre the Giant? I don't know. Seth Rogen. Big show. Yeah. So that is not a WWE. Is that Big John Stud? Yeah. Yeah. Big John Stud is a really good name for a big wrestler. Yeah. Stud with two Ds. Also, a, so is Andre the Giant. Well, yeah. Also a good name. Uh, Metal Gear Solid 4, a little booklet I here. Have yeah, I think I want to say I have one of those too, and I don't know why. But now I do. Uh, <laughs> now you do. Uh, the Stone Cold Truth. Mm. Missing the cover uh, because it was probably one of those remaindered books. Mm -hmm. uh, this is a Stone Cold Steve Austin book. That was a ghost written book. What? He did not Stone write Cold Steve album. Austin with Jim J.R. Ross as told to Dennis Brent. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's did not a anyone novel. Anyone write that book? <laughs> This isn't a novel, it's a, you know, it's a biography thing, mm -hmm. right? I mean, it's, you know. But like, Foley wrote his own. I think Jericho and Edge maybe wrote their own, but like all the other ones, Kurt Angle and The Rock and all that, and they had ghostwriters, or as told to. Little Seamus. Little Seamus. Mm -hmm. This is a better look for Seamus. Mm -hmm. uh, some Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Old David Heroes Bowie. Mojo presents the artist that influenced David Bowie. So... Oh. Oh, it's like the hero. Here's a bunch David of stuff Bowie. that is not not David Bowie. Here's a five track. Uh, here, oh, it's live from '74. There you go. Hmm. I like CSNY a lot. Okay. Oh, all right. Here, you should put these on with that and see if like you catch on fire. Or I don't know what will happen. But... This is my new look for the APW show tonight. Yeah, good call. Jumpo, longtime heroes of our world, a secret no more. Is that a dog? What is that? But Jason knows what that is. It's like a stormtrooper's dog? Is that an anime thing, Drew? Maybe. Maybe. Uh. I do have this. I definitely have this. This is the, is that the, the DVD that... Oh, it came with the, the... Was that with the Steelbook limited one? Yeah, I think so. I have the Steelbook one, but I've never opened it. Yeah. Uh, I bought two copies when it came out. Yeah. Good Lord. Shame it's falling in the garbage. Uh, World of Warcraft Trivial Pursuit. That's... Holy shit. There you go. There you go. Wow, that's cool. 
VHS copy of Rapid Fire with Brandon Lee and Powers Booth. Brandon Lee's the Bruce Lee kid that died, right? The, he was the crow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Destroying <laughs> America, which is a pretty decent skate video. Uh, I can't support that. Oh, yeah, this is the one that has Tony Hawk fucking jumping over a Manx TT cabinet on the back. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. And, and Eric Estrada's in it. Oh, wow. As a cop. <laughs> wow. Wait, so it's like a narrative, like, written movie? Yeah, it's all the like best skate, skate videos have a loose narrative to them. Oh, really? That makes them, like, really... Kind of amazing. Skills to pay the bills. Uh, the Mind's Eye, a computer animation odyssey. Jesus, oh, we watch that. That was in every blockbuster. Yeah. Like 1988 to 2000. Your journey begins at the dawn of creation and moves through the rise of man and technology. Is this supposed to be interactive or anything? No, or? no this is just a. It's a Jan Nickman. Not even. Not not Jan Hammer. Wait. Well, maybe you did the music for it. I don't know. But. This has 600 questions in it. You would play this like three times. Yeah. I feel like I saw this on a TV at a party once. <laughs> Recently? No. Okay. They had the Blu-ray at the party. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, here's a copy, a sealed copy of Space Jam. All right, cool. Commentary by Bugs Bunny, Daffy Duck, and director Joe <laughs> Pitka. Okay, I want to watch that. Yeah. Are they actually making another one with yeah. LeBron James? LeBron, they, they've it is official? I believe so. so like in Variety or something? Burn Up Scramble. Limited edition collector's box. That's Jason's wants that. Uh, it's just one. This is the, one of the things where they sell the box with the first copy and then like, hey, you better buy volumes two and three because uh, you got the box now. Hmm. Anime. That's definitely a Jason thing. I'll put that on his desk. Rental copy of Lord of the Rings. Rewound? No. Hmm. Ah, a copy of The End, which is another pretty good skate video. Just Tony Hawk. Dressed up like a matador. <laughs> uh, that's funny. There's someone jumping over a gas, sta a gas pump at gas station. Hey, this is the the this is totally the Tony Hawk level. Wait, like this is like the Tony one? Hawk bull ring level. Oh, where the bulls run? Oh my god, with the little yeah, yeah. I didn't know that was based on a real thing. Is that the one with the bull pooping and you had to run over like yeah. five bull poops? Yep. Okay. Hey guys, huh. Undercity has how many quarters? Four. Oh, it's, it's right there in the fucking name. Yeah. yeah. Four. Uh, copy. You got mail. Was that made in conjunction with AOL? Because that looks like the AOL... Well, and the, the voice thing that you've got. I think they went and did got the rights to it and stuff. Do you want this plain stuff? Or is it, we've got a lot of it. I'm going to go to controller.com. Okay, all right. You're going to go Probably online. Okay. okay. AOL used to have downloadable we'll celebrity Seamus. voices to tell you that you've got mail stuff. So that's, I had David Letterman for like five years telling that's, me I got mail. That's past my time with AOL. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, I was still getting the free disc emails. Uh, here's the uh, Texas Danny Ranger badge. Just give that to Danny. Here's a, a sealed pack of 2011 trading cards we open it? with The Rock. You should probably open it. Uh, here's a Batmobile for Arkham Knight. Huh. I don't know. They... Huh. Weird. All right, Jeff, make a prediction. How many of these people are active roster members? I have four cards here. Okay, four cards. I'm going to say... Who's been on Raw in the last... In this calendar year? No, no. It is active roster members. Well, that I'll guess on. Okay. I'll say two. Okay. Well, we got the Axe Man here. Okay, Curtis all right. Axel. Yeah, yeah, awesome. From the new Nexus. So but that's that, one. But that doesn't say Curtis Axel on. Does that count? Uh, so Michael that, McGillicuddy. That, that counts. Yeah, okay. Okay. There we go. Yeah, Larry yeah. the Axe. It's the same guy. Chris Masters. Okay. Not, Masterpiece. Not on the roster. No, he's not. Ezekiel Jackson, Big Rick. Not, not on the roster. No, he's not. not on the roster. He's not. And Layla, retired. Oh. So we do have one active roster. Okay, before. good. And the one that matters. Yeah, well, Nicky Clan. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and we've got this uh, European, co or no, I'm sorry, Japanese copy of, is this Tenchu DS? Yeah, right? Yeah. Tenchu for the DS. That's cool. All right. Final Fantasy VII Advent Children bonus disc. It's a run, Ronnie, run. DVD copy of Run, Ronnie, Run. <laughs> oh, sweet. 
the Fantasy Star Universe soundtrack. A boot, uh, sorry, a bootleg copy of Run, Ronnie, Run. That is one of the most disappointing films from a show. Some that people really love it. I still thought it was all right. I, I, it's. I, it had I, a couple I, bits that were funny. Yeah. Yes. A native taken singing naked. Yes. Isn't Jeff Goldblum in that? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Was in that, right? so, Paul Stanley. So Peter Chris, right? I don't know. Do you have the drumsticks? Oh, okay. I don't know much about Kiss. Yeah, that's 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 the right move. Yeah, they're not great. No, they never were. They really never were. Ha! Cool. <laughs> there you go. Enjoy that. Oh. Bubble wrap must be important. Some spicy ketchup and original mustard from Whataburger. Ah. I've heard the spicy ketchup is good. I've not had that. I like the jalapeno ranch. I did everything in that. Huh. Cool. All right. Well, uh, thanks. From, for, thanks, Texas. For that. And then you guys got some stuff got, too, I right? I got a thing. Yeah, right. here. Who wants, who wants camera? Dan, you get camera. Jeff, you get camera. <laughs> People get sick when I hold the camera oh, for mailbags. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. All, All right. right. We have eight minutes left. Okay. Do I need to focus here? Uh, yeah. So the focus is on the, yeah, the outer ring. Okay. This package is from Israel. Which is, and you can look on the side here. Dear citizen, do not open this parcel before verifying if you were expecting a parcel from this return address. I wasn't. Hmm. Uh, also, look at this. Three, sure. three. three uh, exclamation points. Wait. Three over here in, in Hebrew. But that translates to only two in Arabic. Hmm. So, I, I don't know Arabic. I don't know how that works, but... I thought that was interesting. Yeah, no. was, three means something different. Russian over here? Oh, all right. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> uh, on the custom slip, it said snacks. And wow, yes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. Dear Brom Bombers, now that you have a record on the team, I figured I should send you some of the more strange stuff from Parts Unknown. I was also devastated that Jeff couldn't try that exotic crystal last time. So this is my make good on that. Exotic crystal, like crystal meth? Did I, they send us Israeli crystal meth? I, uh, uh, mm, we may need to turn this off. Snacks. After an extra bit of weirdness, everything in this pack was made for Passover, meaning it is super kosher, i.e. made without using any raising agents that uh, soften and lighten doughs and batters. Enjoy, this is awesome. Wow. Uh, okay, Brad, there's a here for you, the Brad Shoemaker personal interest corner. What? I don't know. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay. What? There's, there's a snack in, in there that is a, is a health pickup in Dying Light. Oh, really? What's it called? It's uh, the, the Halva. Halva? Halva. H-A-L-D-A. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. release. Okay. And also, it's tahini-based, like tahini, the stuff in hummus. Oh, yeah. Huh. Oh yeah, I've 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 seen that shape of food before. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Waffle crisps. Halva, you said? Yeah. Here it is. Yeah, I'll try that. You get like I think it's like five or ten health back. Right there. Yeah, ten. Wait, I'm trying to turn the ring yeah. this way. Mm -hmm. Okay, got it. Cool. That's good. All right, Brad, you want to crack into this? Sure. Oh god. Whoa. What? Jeez. All right, we got we got spiralies, we got squares, and we got we got tubes. Tubes. Yeah. So the tubes full of anything? Not, not yet. Chocolate bits. Okay. Ooh, that's all right. Yeah, that does. Sure. Got a nice heft to them. They're unleavened. Really? So they look wafery. They look. Like, try? Oh my god, they do have heft. Yeah, I'll try. Sesame coated with dark chocolate. That sounds. I love sesame. All right. Yeah, sesame's good. Yep. No, it's here. <clears throat> yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. There you go. Oh wow. I okay. Grab, I grab a couple. There's like three kinds in there. Some chocolate and hazelnut. Maybe vanilla. Okay. I, this seems harder to open than the Scottish snacks. Oh wow! Look at it. It's like kind of crumbly. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Real cakey. I want to try that. Oh jeez, wow. Wow. Oh, good. Yeah? Yeah, I'll take one. I'll eat the whole thing. Mmm, like melts in your mouth. Alright, a lot of stuff to get through in here. Coated matzah? Okay, Ooh. yeah. Yeah. I've seen that. Is that really how you spell matzah? I thought it was matzos. 
Yeah, I, f I thought I had an O also. <laughs> what is uh, Poidsnet? Uh, Poidsnet. That's uh, my new website. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> All the ways from Poids. I'm so happy we have more snacks. Long tubes. Mm -hmm. Look, Jason snacks. Yes. I got so hungry during the Mario Party stream, I came out here and I rustled through some stuff and almost ate some expired candy. Oh, really? Yeah, it was really nasty. Sataka Monaka! That's that cat. That's that cat's name. Those are, those are really good. That's, uh, that's it's good. It is actually Israel good. for okay. Garfield. Okay. okay. I don't trust the word you uh, is, that, is that guy? Those look very red and maybe spicy? Are those raspberries? Maybe. Ooh, no, what the hell are those? Alright, three minutes left before the trade embargo lifts. Okay. More tubes? I don't know that I'm good at focusing. Uh, it's, it's tough on that camera, because yeah. we don't have a lot of light in here. Yeah. Uh, more more string, stringy tubes? Ooh. Like That's Chocolate? Cow. That's it, yep. Cow flavor. Uh, mm -hmm. Roast ox crisps. And then... I don't know if you can use wow. Oh, we had a we had a bottle of Cristal. Oh, that's what he was talking about. Yeah, liquid meth. Popping Crist. Okay. Crystal. Exotic flavored carbonated drink. I love exotic flavor. It's my favorite flavor. No, that's yeah, it's, it is the best. Exotic fruits are the best fruits. Also, I have a new rule. I don't just do shit because you tell me to. But you can eat one too. No, I, I just don't, can't. I don't it. want one. Mm -hmm. That's right. a new rule. Cristal. Uh, this is sorry, Brad. What was the name of that guy? Uh, Did he sign it? Dagon. Whoa, that Dagon? Like Dagon. It is. Yeah, it's a fantasy star universe star soundtrack universe. in there. There's some anime that made its way to your desk. It's the game soundtrack for fantasy star. Oh, wow. Thanks, Dagon. Yeah. And Shalom. Okay, here we go. All right. I'm going to yeah. try one of those as soon as I turn this off. Okay. Ow. I hit the TV. <laughs> Why is there a TV here? <laughs>